So I'm sitting here editing uh, our ice tour and I've recorded hmm, at least four trips. Um, I am uploading them to a hard drive and then making my videos off of the external hard drive. However, something's happened and my computer starts running extremely slow to where it won't play some of the videos that are on the hard drive. Um, so I'm going to show what I have, what will play uh, from the earlier. We have fished at three lakes, um, <clears throat> mainly that we uh, fish around our hometown here. And then we have been to Henry's Lake. That was our most recent trip. And I did get a bit of footage from that. It's still on the memory card and it is still available for use. So I'm going to just post up a little montage of the fish that we've caught that I can use. Um, and then I will just cut straight into the Henry's Lake trip. Uh, we fished Twin Lakes and Condi. Um, two lakes around the, the, the town here. And uh, in Twin Lakes we have good luck with trout and black crappie. And then in uh, Condi we caught some monster bass and a few little tiny perch. So let's get right to it. I think I got a bass. Oh, good! You got it. Well, I don't got it yet. Yeah. This is where having a pole with a drag would come in handy. <laughs> you just using your thumb? On the my pointer finger on my left hand. Oh, there's. Yep, it's a bass. Good size. Oh, oh dude! Nice. What? One of my biggest bass. Dude, that's a good one. He's probably two and a half pounds. Yeah. That's a good oh, freaking you bass. Keep that. That, I wonder. I bet this is the one that you had on camera. You think so? Yeah. Dude, that's a good one. Like, dude, don't let it back. Right. Let's Probably get the release. release. Yeah. Do it the, the yeah. Way. Yeah, you gotta. Oh, you should cut. Oh, let him go. There you go. There he goes. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe it's not bigger than the last one. Yeah. All right. All right, bud. Hold on. Let's take it. Let's fight him. Oh, you're getting him up. You're gaining grip. Oh, oh yeah. crap. Dude, <laughs> that's bigger than the one I just caught. Dude. Oh my gosh, Chad. <laughs> oh my gosh. Look at the camera, bud. Look at this thing. Oops. Look up at it. Look up at the camera. That's huge. I know. How did you catch that fish? I don't know. That's so it. awesome. I was, I was um, fishing that um red thing and then... It, I was jigging it. Poof! You're, whoa, you're better than me, bud. <laughs> Your fish is so good. All right, should we let it go? Yeah. Here, let him let it go. All right, you want to let it go? Here, grab on his tail. Grab on his tail. Grab onto it. All right. There you go. <laughs> Dude, give me five. That's the biggest fish. <laughs> Holy crap. Stay here. Okay, reel it. Johnny's smoke. catching him. It's a trout. Drill it. Just... Oh, oh, okay, stop. Is it a good one? Is it right? It's a... Uh, it's a big one. Whoa. And those hooks aren't very strong, so... Yeah. Whoa, Should look we keep him, Johnny? Yeah, let's keep him. Okay. It's a slimer. not the biggest one we caught, well, biggest since you've been here. Johnny, pick that fish up and stand in front of the camera, show it off. Okay. Yeah, put the All right, now hold him with your other hand on his tail. Wow. There, now get, squat down right back up, right next to the hole. Now squat down. Hey, buddy. Ow. Quit biting me. Smack me. There you go, smile. 
There you go. Awesome job, Johnny. Good one. Slender, or uh, what do you got on there? It's a tumbler. That one's spoon. I'm not sure who made it. Oh, easy. Don't get hooked. <laughs> Is it running? Yeah. yeah. I'm trying to think of the right words to say. Here we are. It's harder. <laughs> this is the Five Mile Boys Ice Tour, Henry Lake. Got one on? Mark, how awesome is that jig? <laughs> so awesome. How awesome is so awesome? What? If I ever fish, I can get it. <laughs> Good to know. <laughs> oh. Go on. oh, yes! It's on! It's on like Donkey Kong! Let him have it, let him have it. Back up, Chad. Carson, how do you feel right now? <laughs> mm -mm. Is he coming? <laughs> no way, dude. He's just pulling it. Candy cane Jack.
let's, let's spin around and see if we can get some better lighting. Right. It's terrible. It's terrible because there's snow everywhere. Alright, Mark's gonna get the trophy pick. Well, let's get in here. in and finally on the board we've got like 15 lines out they caught that on a 20 inches uh 18 20 18 it's probably 20 i didn't bring my tape measure so we caught that on a green jig head with just a worm and that's the only rod that's been getting hit today so <laughs> we might change we made a move about like 20 feet just over the top of the hole. Carson's caught two out of now. Nothing else has been hit, so he's got two out of one hole. Uh, most of the people told us to um, find a place that didn't have weeds, so we just moved. We checked, took the fish camera and checked in a couple different holes. And so we just basically changed, you know, 20 feet onto no weeds. Okay. Well, we're nearing the end of our day here at Henry's, and we have two fish, both caught by Carson. We moved one more time uh, right next to the hatchery. There's some open water, and we've seen just litters of fish in there, so we got as close as we possibly can to that. Dropping everything back down and just gonna wait till dark. All right, so we just got done. Water. Uh, fish in Henry's Lake. We left the lake with only one fish. We caught two. Um, bad day. I don't know. Mark's going to give us the, the three pointers on a better trip next year. All right. What's up? Give it to us. Okay, I'm not gonna look at you because I'm driving. But... So I think the like the first thing we could do different next year because we didn't catch crap today was we could probably hit it hit it on early ice and hopefully the fish would be more active then. So catch a few few more fish then. Um, I think that. When we come back, we might want to bring a snowmobile or a four-wheeler so that we can be more versatile and fish a completely different part of the lake than where we fished. Um, and then the third thing is maybe a, a little bit different tackle choice. Uh, I thought I kind of threw the book at it today, but apparently I, I still never found the right thing. So. And, well, I don't know. I was fishing the, the exact same uh, rig as Carson did, and he caught those two almost back to back. Yeah. And they, I had the same rig on, and uh, my pole never got hit. So, so I don't know what's up with that, but uh, yeah. So uh, a little bit different tackle. Uh, try and maybe hit a, a different area on the lake and try to hit it during early ice. Except the problem for me is I'm going to do a late season deer hunt again next year. So <laughs> I, uh, I don't know, maybe I'll miss out on the early ice next year. I'm not sure. So, yep, one and only trip to Henry's this year was uh, kind of a bust for me, but I had fun. Bust for me too. 
How about you, Carson? It wasn't very much of a bust for me. I got two fish and I enjoyed myself. I'll probably um, come back on early ice next year because I live in Rexburg, so it's not that big of a problem for me to come back. And I enjoyed my time here. I think that maybe if we got here a little early in the morning, we may have done a little better. But that's about it. Yeah, that too. Hit it, hit it in the morning. I think we missed the morning bite, but yeah. it has a lot to do with the crappy roads. The weather was good. Whatever, yeah. Maybe we'll crappy coming up. spend the night at a cheap hotel next year. Yeah. Or, or is it cafe? Spend the night <laughs> on the lake, yeah. <laughs> we can bring the wall down. They're like yeah. refugees for a day. I mean, that doesn't bother me. There you have it, folks three things to do better next year and hopefully a better day. <laughs>